following is a special presentation of WEDU Tampa, St. Petersburg, Sarasota. The song of the gondolier is heard a long way from Italy. Dear Journal, we start with an oddity on the Gulf Coast this time. In the city of Venice, there's a newspaper called The Gondolier. That makes sense, Venice, Gondolier. But in fact, in Venice, aside from that newspaper, there is no gondolier, there is no gondola. But up the road a few miles in Sarasota, that's a different story. On the canals along Sarasota's Philippi Creek, not far from the bustling traffic of US 41, you'll find an ambiance that speaks Italian. Buongiorno, signore. Boats of every shape and size speckle the Gulf Coast waters, but it's not every day you see the most romantic of waterway vessels. It's not every day you find a gondola. Normally, on the sunset time, to come out of this bridge, it's magic. You'll go right into the sun. Beautiful. Boris Sotskin is Sarasota's gondolier. Boris, B-O-R-I-S. Yeah, no Natasha on the boat. Just Boris. His sparkling personality is as distinctive as his boat. His homeland, more than a stone's throw across the Mediterranean, Boris is from Ukraine. I always say, if you Italians cannot do it here, why Ukrainian can't? During the one-hour journey, everyday worries are left back at the dock. Passengers are treated to serenity, romance, a little bit of Italian lore. Adesso, signore, questa è la tradizione unica in Venezia, Italia. When you first time on a gondola going under the bridge, gentlemen, you have to kiss your lady. So it brings luck to the relationship. And you stay forever together. Boris launched his business six years ago with a two-seater fiberglass gondola he built by hand. He later built a 25-foot boat for larger groups. The added weight never a factor. And people ask, is any motors on the boat? I said, yes, two diesels, left and right. Yeah, I can go forever. Buongiorno. Boris's gondola has become backyard entertainment for neighbors along Philippi Creek. How you doing? Are you kidding me? They love it. And actually, some people said, hey, they have to raise the property value here just because the gondola is here. Other residents aren't so sure. Now we're going to get lots of noise from this guy. Hey, guys. Normally, I'm singing here. And they sing with me all the time. Wow, we have lots of noise. On the water, oar in hand, is where Boris feels most at home, at peace. Growing up, it gave him refuge from a country ruled with an iron fist. Started when I was 13. And I always dreamed about something on the water to enjoy. I'm rowing all the time, I'm coaching crew team, but this is kind of my love. See the blades? It has to be in the water. That's it. He coaches the Osprey Oars youth rowing team, and in the early 80s was himself a member of the Soviet Union national rowing team. The Soviet boycott of the 1984 Olympics denied his chance at a gold medal, but never diminished his love for the sport. It's a life itself. It's teach me how to live with other people. It teach me how to listen to the water. I meditate on that. Wow, this is, I never, I will die on the boat. It's impossible to quit. I used to be Navy officer, so I know a lot about boats. He was also once a bodyguard for a politician in Yugoslavia, and then, knowing no English, came to America to the Gulf Coast, where the water felt a bit like home. It's 
salt water, lots of rowing, lots of water, lots of swimming, maybe the big board. So that everything, what my adult life is, starting at 17, I remember from that. The shell and gondola, two completely different boats joined by the ardent blade of one man. It's nice, it's beautiful, very quiet, and very peaceful. It cannot be any negative thoughts or energy or anything around this. A good gondolier isn't just defined by navigating skills. It demands something Boris never learned in the Navy or as a master rower. I always say, you got the job, you got the voice. You, can, you cannot not sing on the gondola. You have to, you will, because your heart is singing there. Gara tornosti sirene, care garda non cantate. Sometimes people, when they find out I'm from Russia, from Ukraine, they ask me, oh, can you sing Russian? I say, sure, but hey, it's like it, uh, French fries in Italian restaurant instead of spaghetti, right? Word of mouth keeps his business afloat, but probably will never make him a millionaire. The gondola, it's my love, it's my passion. I never quit it, even if it doesn't give me a penny. I'll write for my friends, for my family, for myself. But I hope one day it's bring me a good steady job too, because I can work on that thing until I die. For those who ride his gondola, Boris's infectious enthusiasm is ripples spreading. Grazie, signore. Volare. Whoa. Cantare. Oh, oh, oh. Nel blu. Dipintori blu. Felice riscare lassù. No wonder my happy heart sing. Yola has given me wings. You can order this or any other volume of a Gulf Coast Journal with Jack Perkins on high-quality DVD format for just $19.99 plus shipping and handling. Call 1-800-354-9338 or visit our website at wedu.org. Volare! Grazie.